Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to discuss the example for complex number. Given we have the z sub 1 is equal to 6 plus 3i, and the z sub 2 we have 5 minus 2i. Verify the conjugate of z sub 1 minus z sub 2 is equal to conjugate of z sub 1 minus the conjugate of z sub 2. So let's begin with conjugate of z sub 1 minus with the conjugate of z sub 2. So here we have the situation. 6 minus 3i minus, we have the bracket, 5 plus with the 2i. So if we simplify, we will have 1, continue, minus with the 5i. So that is the conjugate for z sub 1 minus the conjugate of z sub 2. Next, move on with another part. So here we have the conjugate, the z sub 1 minus the z sub 2. So if we substitute, we will have 6 plus with the 3i minus, we have the bracket, 5 minus 2i. So here we have 1, continue, we have plus with the 5i. So that is the z sub 1 minus with the z sub 2. If we conjugate of the situation, so we will have 1 minus 5i. As we notice that, we have 1 minus 5i, which is equal to 1 minus 5i. So as a conclusion, the conjugate of z sub 1 minus z sub 2 actually is equal to Conjugate of z sub 1 minus with the conjugate of z sub 2. So that is the situation we verify. Continue. Find the argument of z sub 1. Step number 1 must have the diagram. Then find the location for z sub 1, which is 6 plus 3i. So which is located in the first quadrant, z sub 1. Here we have the angle, alpha, basic angle. Continue. Tangent alpha is equal to 3 over 6, where we have tangent alpha is equal to 1 over 2. So by referring to the calculator, alpha is equal to 26 by 5, 7 degree. Next is to find the argument of the situation. So the argument of z sub 1 is located over here. So argument of z sub 1 is equal to 26 by 5, 7 degree as well. Express in the form of radian. So the argument of z sub 1 is equal to 0 0.464 radian. If you are new here, kindly consider subscribing to this channel and share this video to your friend. Thank you so much for watching this video. Bye.